What's up YouTube? Welcome back. My name's Harrison. Welcome to Truck Talk. Today we are looking at Mr. Upchurch. Mr. Upchurch, you brought us a new video. You brought us a new song and you said that in this that it is like one of the most like crazy outlandish ones that you've done and I saw like other people like comment like yo this is crazy. Um, yeah, so I wanted to check it out. Sorry we're doing it in the vehicle. You know, traveling times you got to do traveling things. So this is Upchurch said effort official music video man he's got the atv he's got the four-wheeler out he's got the chicken he's got buckets pouring something in a bucket pail metal pail anyways man I, i'm ready for it i think it's gonna be some crazy stuff i heard like he's like uh trolling some other people i don't know i'm looking forward to see what it's gonna be we'll go ahead and check it out uh, again, if you have not yet, please hit the subscribe button. I am trying to get to a thousand subscribers. From that point, we'll set another goal. We'll set a new reach and we will get there as well. But for the time being, a thousand is the goal. So help me get there. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button, please. Like the video so YouTube thinks that I'm doing good. Please make sure you give it a thumbs up and comment if you would like to see other reactions. So comment down below. Also check the links in the description. I have other social media things in there, other accounts. I have an account for me and my wife for uh, investigation and crime solve murder stuff like that so please check that out as well uh yeah all right so mr upchurch let's see what you got going on buddy i'm looking forward to it here we go right now oh they gonna be mad about this one boys oh well goodbye fuck award shows fuck yeah i heard it i saw that he posted on instagram that he bu busted his was his gold or his platinum record? Like I know, but th those things you gotta cherish, dude. I don't know. Two up and comer and his female clothes with his glitter on his face and his pre-written songs. He ain't from around here, and neither is his dude. Mom, but the guy dude, dude, that is so true, though. All these people from Nashville, they are not. There's a lot of country folks that come there and like get signed deals that are not country. They just fit into that genre because that's where they're told to go. I know Upchurch hates that. Fuck the radio and the new up and comer and his female ah. clothes. With his glitter on his face and his pre written songs. He ain't from around here and neither is his boss. But the guy in the office with his jerry curl and his hands super soft like a teenage ah. girl. Fuck social media and them long hashtags. Which a bitch made album cover looking like a. <laughs> yeah, I said the word fuck in a song ah. of charts. I mean, he's calling them out, right? He's caught like half of these half of these dudes are dressed like females nowadays that are up here. Um, you know, I know I know for a while like the tight jean thing was cool. I mean I mean nice pants are nice pants, right? But one like you're consistently wearing tight jeans. It's a little much, fellas. It's a little much. And I, I like the way he's calling that, talking about glitter on your face, you're coming up right and singing these people other 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 songs or these songs that other people are, are writing for you, right? Uh, in your girlfriend's clothes. I mean, you look at some of the people music that's going on today. He ain't lying. He's not lying. And them long hashtags, which a bitch made album cover looking like a. <laughs> yeah, I said the word fuck in a song on the charts. Probably breaking beta male, a can break your heart. With the mocha lattes and sparkly blue stars. Sitting in the room trying to fucking talk like us. We don't need. Another pretty boy singing pretty songs. What up, Luke? You doing all right, bro? Mm. Yo, he is straight trolling, Luke. Here? Mm. Hold on, hold on. Aren't Luke and him go. friends, or did I miss something? Am I, do I, did I miss something? Because, see, this is the song he did with him. I like Luke Combs. I mean... Pretty boy singing pretty songs. No. What up, Luke? You doing all right, bro? Mm. You want a beer? No. No? Okay, well... Suit yourself. You act like it broke your heart or something. Ah. Country music was a rooster. You probably wouldn't know it don't lay eggs. If country music was a set of guys. If country music was a rooster, you probably wouldn't know it doesn't lay eggs. Got gas, you probably get stabbed in the hand. If country music was made to chickens in a ticket, would you have gone bus covered on your oh, head? Yeah. Yeah, this guy's such a fool, man. So by now, 
You probably figured it out. Mainstream pissed me off and made me have a dirty mouth. But on the flip side, here's a little known fact. I was born in Music City, still getting no slack. I got country songs tipping a hundred million. Get played at every mud park across Dixie. Not to mention female singers want to come and frisk me. Especially when we're stoned. So he, so it's right. There he was trolling Luke and he's trolling Kane Brown. Boy, oh boy. Now, 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 Ryan, I know you went out there to try to go help him because y'all live close by and you, you, uh, you were part of the being lost, uh, thing. So this is, this is probably, so maybe him and Luke are good. He's just, he's just playing along and making a joke about everything. Yeah, I've been out here for hours. Where'd you come from? Careful, I'll be honest. No, 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 you need to go that way. You need to get out of here, dude. If they find out a country singer was lost in the woods, fucking CMT gonna eat this up, fucking. Country music was a rooster. You probably wouldn't know it don't lay eggs. If country music was a set of gang type gas, you'd probably get stabbed in the head. If country music was baby chickens in a ticket, would you have corn dust covered on your bridges? I am the country like rooster feed to a bucket. Just fucking tell This is hilarious. Yeah, he is, he is straight up like telling truth though. I imagine everyone in the surrounding area probably hates all these people coming through. I mean, aside from the people that move there to want to make it in music and stuff, like, and everyone, everyone who's, everyone who listens to country music will tell you the same thing. Country music is not the same as it used to be. These people out here putting on this, putting on these shows and whatnot, these are not real country music artists. This is not the same type of feeling. And Ryan Upchurch makes that very vocal and very clear that he does not support it, right? He does not like it. Now he has friends inside the industry, he certainly does, but you know, he sees what happens on the inside and how like stupid and mainstream it is to put it forward. And it's just like anything else. The mainstream stuff is just polluted. We ain't got room. Bitch, I get the same spans on my Spotify list as your newest artist, dude. Shots yeah, fired, though. Shots fired, though. Rooster. On my independent stuff, I'm going to get the same type of spins on my Spotify as you do with your label. It's true. Or more. I'd probably be a big Cuban dom. If country music was a six-cock derby in Kentucky, be the last one standing tall. If country music was a rock string, a bell hot, was a rock string, a bell hot, break loose and strut the yard. Because we are the country like Bruce to feed to a bucket. And we like songs to say fuck it. <laughs> yeah, fuck This dude is ridiculous, man. I love how it calls out the industry, though. Oh, God. Man, y'all boys are fools. These dudes are literally fools, man. But I like that their stance on this is like, you know, they're taking charge. I mean, Ryan's proved it again and again how he can take charge of his own life and it doesn't need help from anyone else to get things done like that. And he just, he just gets it done. And I really, really, really respect that. And I think a lot of people do. And he gets crazy amount of plays, crazy amount of streams. He gets a, he has a huge fan base, and it's all because of the work that he's put in. So hats off to him. Ryan, Mr. Upchurch, that was a very funny video, a very true video. It's funny because it's true, but it's sad because it's true. So anyways, thank you guys very much. Hope you enjoy it. Hope you like Ryan's new song. Please go make sure you check out his stuff as well. All right, thank you so much, and as always, be blessed.